What bothers you most? If God was like one of us, God would be killing himself 8 billion times over each passing day. Oh yeah, really now? Beauty versus Ugly is one obsession that's worse than all the dreaded diseases men have ever seen. In a perfect world where everyone is considered equal to everybody else by the virtue of being human and alive. Beauty versus Ugly would be classified as non tolerable in this life to all the 8 billion souls in our universe. The fact that God made all of us differently complete with unique facial and bodily appearances reveals a lot about how God actually looks. What bothers you most in your life about yourself versus how other people misconfigure your image is neither here nor there. If you want to wrinkle early before you age, keep on listening and stressing about other people's opinions about your looks. You look as good as you can feel on the inside. You see, your face can't fake what the heart's not feeling deep inside. What bothers you most? The way you feel always affects the way you appear outwardly. Our facial expressions always take their cues from the heart. You can fake a smile, giggle, or even laughter, but you can't fool your own heart. It's always next to impossible to feel excited, celebrate, and dance outwardly without the driving force straight from the heart. What bothers you most? You better believe me now. It's hard to ignore other people's criticism without allowing the heart to embrace and comfort you. What you hear through your ears will not and cannot harm till you digest and believe the lies about you. What bothers you most? Hello. I am here to tell you that God has never seen a mirror in all eternities. Why? Because with God there's no shadow of turning. In simple language, nothing in this world and in the spiritual has power enough to reflect the image of God. Do you want to feel good about yourself despite all the critical tongues around? Welcome to God's real world. What bothers you most? Since God cannot see himself in a mirror like us, he decided to create man hoping to see his own reflection in man. Hey wait a minute here. What happened after? Since way back in the Garden of Eden, God like a restless potting is. Decided Adam wasn't enough and so God created Eve, the woman. What bothers you most? Thousands upon thousands of years rolled over each other since day one of Adam and Eve. God is still frantically searching for his image eight billion souls later. It is therefore incumbent upon all men to stop looking for God in temples, synagogues, churches, mosques, and anywhere except in each other's faces. What bothers you most? Are you aware the person you've been cussing and calling ugly is actually like spitting into God's face? Since all of us can feel happy and sad and even beautiful and ugly, why don't you allow the image of God to lift you higher than all venomous spits you get from your haters? What bothers you most could be nothing and extremely unnecessary if it's about how others feel about your looks. Walk tall and walk straight up. Dance all the way to having a fulfilling day you deserve. God is smiling down on you because he sees a fraction of his own image in your dashing looks. What bothers you most doesn't bother God at all. Forget all the sins. Everyone is beautiful in the sight of God. I know that I'm talking to you.